Rob Tupper for Boxing News, joined by Josh Kelly. We're here in Manchester after Chris Eubank Jr.'s revenge win over Liam Smith. Josh, I know, friend of Liam Smith, so a difficult one to watch, but a great performance from Chris Eubank Jr. Yeah, I mean, uh, he just boxed, he boxed, didn't he? He boxed. And um, he looked like he turned clocks back a little bit. He, he had the work rate we used to see him do. And obviously, getting in his old age, we never thought he could get that back. So he's obviously worked hard in camp. He's brought, he's brought uh, everything he needed to do, and it's worked for him, so, yeah. Didn't quite have the same um, intensity from Liam Smith this time around. What do you think that potentially was? I'm not sure. I've heard he rolled his ankle. I'm not sure if there was any. Um, you know what I mean? I'm good. Yeah, all good, brother. Sorry, mate. Yeah, good, brother. I didn't know there was any things were weird or I don't know. There's, there's cracks of life. There's just things what get in the way outside of boxing. Them are the things that affect boxing more than the boxing and train itself. So you just got to. Um, yeah, it's not. It wasn't him tonight, but. He can come back, and if he, re he really wants to come back and knows it weren't in fully at 100%, then he can come back and get the trilogy on. And on Chris Eubank Jr., I just said to your trainer, Adam Booth, it seems as though we saw Chris Eubank Jr. return to that more attritional style, the volume punching, letting his hands go, seemed to suit him a lot more this time around. Yeah, he, he was Yeah, he was, he was good, he was good. I see a few gaps myself, I wouldn't mind exposing that, but he was good, yeah, he was good. You're teasing us there, Josh. Oh, mate, listen, it's not a tease. I'm ready. At the drop of a hat, I'm ready. Do you know what I mean? I'm not about these fantasy fights. I'm about real fights. I've stepped in my guys well above where I should have been stepping in at the time in my career. And I've I, um, I've learned from it, come through it. And um, I'm a better fight. You see me at 154, I'm full now. And um, 160, I'll be even fuller. So I'll tell you where it is. I wouldn't be getting hit off none of them jobs. No. OK, well, if it's against Chris Eubank Jr. or whoever, we look forward to see you back in the ring. When can that be? December, I think. December. So, yeah, I think I'm back December. It'll be, uh, be good. I can't wait, mate. I can't wait. Obviously, disappointed with the, with the result tonight, but I cannot wait to get back on myself. We look forward to seeing it. Josh Kelly, thanks very much for speaking to Boxing. Cheers, mate. Thank you, bro.